Alright guys, um, if you can hear me, that's good, if you can't, well, sucks to be you, <laughs> but yeah, um, one of my friends been wondering how to move lights in a cop car to a different cop car, pretty much, and considering it's been two years since I've made one of these, and it's changed a lot, at least I've changed a lot in my model making, and how I do my things, which I hardly move lights as much as I used to. Which I mean, I still move them, but I probably got a little rusty. But yeah. I'm just gonna search up random models. I literally have not even done anything. Alright. Now with the older models, they used to be not as. How I say it integrated. So now the lights are into the light light. So as you can see here, literally, if I uh, was to hold on, let me just. I'm just gonna use this because I know for a fact. Yeah, these lights probably gonna suck. Maybe I don't know. But yeah, we're going to go in here and test this out. Now, um, uh, where was I going with this? Um, now, as I join into here, you will see that the lights on the van is much different than the lights on the, um, top right here. If the game will look. Um, that's because they're two different models by two different people built them. So, the one in the Ford Interceptor is probably going to have more internal lights. As you can tell, there is a light right here. Now, if I was to jump in this vehicle and press the, the press J key, that will turn off the lights, okay? And the horn doesn't work, but R is the uh, sirens and all that. R, T, Y, F, G, and H are usually your main keys, and L is your lights, and C is your um, turn signals, X is your other turn signal, and X does nothing. Literally, I don't think. Yeah, X does nothing, which sucks, but hey. Now, as we go into. I really don't care. As we go into this vehicle, you can see that this has a different light manual. So this one is different from the one that was in that um, for Explorer. Now, to. Change over the lights, you're going to have to do a few things, which is going to take time. You're going to have to learn, pretty much. What you're going to have to do is probably have to remove all the lights, maybe. Or, this might be a simple job, and, um, literally, you're only going to have to, um, oh, uh, what is it, what is it, what is it called again? I hate these type of models where they double up. Like, I don't get why you would do that. Um, now with my models, I usually just remove the shadows just because I like to do that. Um, but back on what I was saying, see how it says light bar and light bar one, or both these. These are light bars. This is what you want to look at. Now, if you go into this body, you will see there's one light bar. What you're going to look at is, see how these models are almost exactly the same, except they're missing a few things. Now, this might cause problems, because I can't remember how I used to do it, but I think I can move these over to him. This is going to be a test. It's been a while since I've done this.
because I usually am able to find the model I want with the lights I want because people are now using the lights I like. So, if I do that, um, which light bar is this one? Literally, I'm going to just... God, it's been a while. I'm literally just going to remove that light bar. Just make it easy on myself so I don't have to worry about it. I want to know where is that light bar from. Oh, these are the headlights and backlights. Okay, never mind. I shouldn't have added that one. Wait. Yeah. I think that's for the headlights and all that. Um, This is the one I want to be editing. <sighs> what you want to do is hit backspace. This is going to be a test. I do not know what this works. And I'm going to go into here. Now you see a pickup, pickup thing and GUI giver. All that. Don't worry about that. I will tell you what those are in the future. So, what you want to do is take this siren control, copy it, I want you to paste it into the vehicle you would like to paste it into. Now, we're going to test it, which may or may not work. If it does not work, that means I would have to move every light that I want one by one. Which, I mean, if I was you, I wouldn't do that. That'd take forever. But, this might work. I can't remember if this is exactly how I did it. But I know for sure. Ooh. It doesn't look like it's going to work. No. That sucks. That really does suck. Just saying. Um... Yeah, if you usually see this, that means it's broke. I broke it. Um, it might also be because this is a different type of light script. Because if I press, never mind. Okay. Okay. Um. Well then, if you. To have run into this problem, which I'm going to use the same exact models, what you're going to have to do, which is not what I like to do, but I usually wouldn't recommend it, because it's way easier just to find a different model and edit it to make it your own, or heck, make your own model and do the script yourself, or actually move the lights yourself and do all that now if you do if you oh my god excuse me um if you would actually like to move it it's pretty simple how, how you move it it's um first of all i'm going to ungroup that um first of all you're going to if you would like you can remove all of this remove it all doesn't matter because you've got the stuff already. Next thing. Remove that. I would, um... Damn it. Didn't I mean to... Ungroup. And ungroup. Now you pretty much have everything ungrouped. Which you might not have working lights anymore, but hey. You can always fix those, that's easy to fix. Which I wouldn't have removed both of those, but for um what I'm doing, I am. What you're going to do. I don't care, I wasn't trying to do that, I was trying to copy it. Copy, and I'm going to move it. I did not mean to do that. I'm going to duplicate it, actually, sorry. And I'm going to leave it there. Next time, I'm going to move it into body. And then I'm going to copy this. Copy. And boom. 
and you're going to paste it in the driver. Mother trucker. Paste that into the driver. And then you're going to go here. Which this is just an easy step. I'm not going to move it one by one. That would take forever. I don't have that kind of time. I gotta make another video on how to, um... Oh, what is it? On how to edit the scripts and stuff like that. I do have my own custom GUI I used for... See? Alright, I want you to... Right, you press J. Boom. It makes that noise. It's fine. That means they're turning off. J. Boom. Press J again. They turn off. As you can tell, this is a custom made lighting. As you can tell, because of the bad lights. Which I mean, are easy to make. I mean, heck, all you do is do a few things. They're not easy to make, but they're eh, kind of easy to make. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it on how to move lights. If you need to be, you have to move them. Um, what I wouldn't do if you are going to move the lights and change the script and all that, I would not do what I did and remove the lights. I would have kept them in there and chose the lights that you would like to put where like you see how you see these lights put them there you'll be able to copy the position of the lights on this light bar and paste it into this light bar but you're going to have to do it one by one do not select all of them and they're saying that they're automatically going to go in the position you want they won't trust me i've tried but this is a two year old, oh, two year update. It's been two years since I made this. So I've pretty much gotten what I need to do or learn what to help and what not to do. But yeah, I also have a new game out. It's Mano, but in DOJ. If you guys would like to check it out, it will be in the description along with my uh, group. I would love to see you guys uh, join it. Also, please like, subscribe, all of that. Um, yeah, thank you for, oh my god, 300,000 views on Roblox. 26,000 plus views on YouTube and 125 subscribers of the time I'm recording this. Thank you so much. I've been doing YouTube for a while now. This is not my first channel. I've had a few others. But yeah, five years on Roblox. Probably plus five years. I've played Roblox for a while. But yeah. Um, the next episode that should come out is on um, the, um, the interior scripts of this so you see whoops wrong one you see how um you have this stuff wait yeah you have this stuff the internals the values and all this i will show you how to edit this which i have my own script which i will not be releasing to the public i'm sorry it will come out after i'm done because i do have a new one that I am working on trying to get and edit and do what I want it to look like. So yeah, um, please again, thank you so much. Hope you enjoyed. Hope this was um, helpful. Like, subscribe again, please. And I'll see you guys later. Peace.